now, NBC5 first warning weather. 745, Brian Warren, it feels like a long time since we've seen rain. I feel like we've gotten a lot of snow, and now instead of the white stuff, it's the wet stuff. Well, white back tomorrow. That's uh, where we've been up and down <laughs> a lot lately. So yeah, we've got some rain to deal with today and then some snow tomorrow. We'll talk about that here coming up in a moment. And in the in between, a, a pretty nice Sunday on the way after we get rid of these rain showers this morning. We'll warm up to near 60 later on today with some breaks of sunshine. This morning, already much warmer now than we've been dealing with for several mornings now. It's 38 in Plattsburgh, 41 in Burlington, mid 30s too from St. John down towards Montpelier and Lebanon right now at 35. A little cooler in Messina at 30. We'll talk more about why that's important here in just a moment. Looks pretty good as we look down Church Street. The marketplace quiet on this Sunday morning. Should be nice to get out for a little walk there later today though. 41 right now with a mainly cloudy sky. Some showers on the way. Mainly cloudy too across northern New York. Plattsburgh right now with a cloudy sky. It's 38 as we look from the city over Lake Champlain towards the east with a south southeast wind at 11 miles per hour. Here comes that rain this morning. Talked about the 30 degree temperature in Messina. They've been seeing some freezing rain this morning too. So until it warms up a little bit and we get rid of some of those pockets of colder air, just be prepared. Might run into a little icing situation. Some of the colder hollows of northern New York, northern St. Lawrence, Franklin counties could see that. This moves through though, and then we get back in on some breaks of sunshine a little bit later on this afternoon. Some of that heavier moisture now making its way through St. Lawrence County. We'll get into Franklin County here over the next little bit. And most of northern Vermont, uh, most of Vermont, uh, eastern New Hampshire gets in on this over the next several hours as well. Notice back towards the west, though, a little bit of clearing. And I think that's where we get in on those breaks of sunshine as we head through later on today. Here's future casts. The rain moves through this morning, breaks of sunshine this afternoon, kind of destabilizes the environment just a little bit to touch off some more showers later on this afternoon. Figure two, four, six o'clock, that line kind of moves through. Maybe some rumbles of thunder uh, with those two, and then it quiets down overnight, partly cloudy. Tomorrow, we've got rain and snow on the way. Looks like mainly snow to the north, mainly rain to the south, and a little bit of a wintry mix there in between. That's with us for most of tomorrow. It looks pretty messy. Kind of moves out on Monday night. Tuesday, we get back in on a mix of sun and clouds much better. And mild, too, for the middle of the week as temperatures get up into the mid-40s. How much snow are we talking about tomorrow? Not a lot. An inch or two maybe in the higher elevations across northern New York, northern Vermont, where it stays snow the longest. And a little bit of a glaze of ice, too, that we'll have to watch for as well. Again, where we get that wintry mix, and it doesn't take a whole lot sometimes to cause problems on the road. So just be aware of that tomorrow. Meanwhile, today, enjoy the breaks of sunshine this afternoon. After those showers move through this morning, we'll be in the mid-50s to near 60 degrees. It'll feel nice a little bit later on today. Down to 42 tomorrow with that wintry mix again. Snow to the north, rain to the south. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, we clear out. Partly sunny all of those days. Mid 40s by Wednesday and Thursday. Looks like another chance for some rain moving in by the end of the week. Friday into next Saturday. Rain and snow possible.